Hey YouTube, Michigan Edge here. Uh, today I have this review uh, that I want to do for you. I was driving home from work the other day and I drove by my local uh, Army Surplus store and I found this beautiful uh, Mora knife here, made in Sweden. Okay. I've heard nothing but good about these knives here, so I wanted to pick one up uh, just to kind of see what they were all about. And uh, to get the specs out of the way on this knife here, it's a fixed blade. It's made in Sweden. It's called the Mora Companion Knife in an orange model. Okay. The handle is a plastic handle and it has a rubber grip over mold on it. The steel is a cold rolled Sandvik stainless steel. The knife weighs in at roughly 3.9 ounces overall. It has a blade length of 4.1 inches, an overall length of 8.6 inches. The blade thickness is roughly 0.10 inches or 2.5 mill millimeters thick. Okay, the blade has what they call a scandy grind. It's uh, it's like flat from here on up. And from here on down, it's kind of flat ground. It's a, it's called a Scandi grind. Okay, the sheath is an orange thermoplastic uh, molded sheath. It has a belt loop here where you can hook this to your belt, which is kind of nice that you don't have to actually loop your belt through there. It has a drain hole in the bottom for water to drain out. And it fits very nicely with the knife. It snaps into place. And it doesn't uh, doesn't rattle or anything. It stays in there pretty tight. Okay. Just to go over some things on this knife here. Uh, I used this knife a little bit out, outside. I made a fire. And I did some uh, whittling and some uh, light duty batoning with it out there. And this knife right here is well known for a good budget uh, bushcraft knife. And I have to say it is very impressive. Um, so far, everything I've seen that came out of Sweden is very high quality. The blade is uh, is flawless. And what kind of interests me on the knife is the blade thickness is actually a decent thickness. I expected something like a fillet knife when I seen pictures of the knife before. Uh, just to show you roughly uh, quickly on how this knife cuts. It's a really good cutter. This is a piece of... Uh, uh, just regular uh, stick that I pulled off a tree. It's still living, so it's soft. You can kind of see that the feather cuts pretty good with it. It's very good at skinning and shaving, preparing fires. And a piece of dead wood here. It cuts dead wood pretty good too. So uh, yeah, you can prepare, prepare fires pretty easily with this here. Uh, just a great, great little knife. Uh, in the paper here, just to show you the paper here, slice is very good. You can kind of you can see how sharp that is. It's feathers, feathers, cuts that you've already made. Uh, so yeah, after taking this knife out and uh, beating it a little bit and whittling and doing some light duty batoning, uh, it was still able to cut paper very good. So the steel is uh, very good, uh, very high quality. One of the best things, too, about this knife, everybody, is I paid $15 for it. Uh, if you go on Moore's website or look on Amazon, they have knives all similar to this here. They all look pretty similar with different uh, lengths or different handle materials. And it looks like all their knives are roughly anywhere from $8 to $20. So very good quality, uh, good budget knife. And in my opinion, the knife's made to last, and it just... It feels great in the hand. The hand just fits real nice. The knife fits real nice in the hand. I'd have to say it's honestly uh, one of the nicest feeling knives I've ever felt in my hand. And I'm very impressed with the knife. And this year, uh, I'm actually going to use this knife when I go deer hunting. Uh, I have lost the knife before in the past, so I kind of like this orange model here. Uh, if I drop this in the woods, uh, it'll make it easier to locate or, or uh, not lose. So. Uh, for $15, you can't go wrong. I highly recommend this. I actually have one more on order in uh, carbon steel. It's the Mora Classic 2. Uh, but here you have it, the Mora Companion Knife. 
in fluorescent orange. Uh, pick one up. Thanks, you two.